modes of attachment of calculus to the tooth surface. Calculus is a mineralized dental plaque. Thorough removal of calculus is mandatory for prevention and treatment of periodontal disease. It also helps in healing and reattachment. Attachment of calculus to the tooth surface is important to understand as different manners of attachment can decide the relative ease or difficulty to remove the calculus. So there are four modes of attachment of calculus to the tooth surface. First is the attachment by means of organic pellicle on cementum and enamel. Second is the mechanical locking into the surface irregularities that is the presence of caries or resorption lacunae. Third way is the close adaptation of the undersurface of calculus to the depressions or the gently sloping mounds of the unaltered cemental surface. And finally the penetration of bacterial calculus into the cementum. In the first type, attachment by means of organic pellicle on the cementum and enamel. An organic pellicle is seen interposed between the cementum and the calculus. In the second method of mechanical locking into the surface irregularities, calculus can be seen attached to the carious lesions or also the cemental resorption lacunae. Calculus mechanically interlocks with the irregularities of the cemental surface. In the third way, there is close adaptation of the undersurface of calculus to the depressions or the gently sloping mounds of the unaltered cemental surface. And finally, the fourth method is the penetration of bacterial calculus into the cementum. In this method, the undersurface of calculus shows the presence of bacteria that penetrates into the cementum for the attachment. All these four types of attachment are seen at histological levels and under the scanning electron microscope at different magnifications. You can find the link to MCQs for this topic in the description of the video. We hope you liked the video and if you did, please subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell for update on new videos.